that's not cool. Like everything's yeah. up in the air, and we're just here for each other in the process. Yeah. Well, you'll be the one thing that's consistent. On oh, but it's, <laughs> you'll be my consistent oh. person. <laughs> First. <laughs> <sighs> That's why we're here to share our experiences and hopefully you can learn something from it. Or you can just let with us. In this episode of Women in the Wild, what are we talking about? We're actually thanking you guys for tuning in to entire to the entire season one. Um, we started filming in January. We're filming this today in June. June 9th. June 9th. Yeah. So we've been on a journey and it's kind of fun that you've been sticking around with us listening on Spotify, Anchor, Apple Podcasts, watching us on IGTV, YouTube, and then keeping up with us weekly in between uploads on our Instagram stories. Thank you so much for tuning in. There's some of you that have literally reached out to me or Adrian after every episode, which is awesome. We've also met some of you through the podcast following, which is awesome. Like we have some people from freaking Brazil. Yes. <laughs> that I didn't even know. Mm -hmm. It's like that are that were my friends before. So we're also making friends and building a community yeah. here. And we're so thankful for you guys. And also we're very thankful for some of the feedback we've been getting yeah. on season one, um, which we plan on integrating for mm -hmm. season two like yeah. for example guests yes as much as you guys have been listening to us we've also been listening to you so <laughs> we've got a lineup of guests for season two and the kind of episodes that we wrote about are kind of similar to the structure of season one where like we do pre-plan these things intentionally we want you guys to actually learn and get something out of it so the guests that we have introduced or we are going to be bringing on our Incredible people that actually know what they're talking about so that we're not just rambling out of our asses. And also you can hear other perspectives and get other kinds of advice from people that are more professional. Yeah, and are beyond our bubble. Mm -hmm. I mean, we want to be uncomfortable. Yes. That's what we want to do, but also vulnerable. Exactly. <laughs> so we're just, you know, upping a little bit the quality of the topics. It's not just about love this time, but we're also gonna touch on some more serious things, like for example, our experience with the coronavirus and the pandemic, mm -hmm. and both of us moving during yes. the pandemic. Um, this is my new home, which is very different from when you were saying season one. And also Adrian moved to a new home at the, like two months ago. Yeah, so like April 15, yeah, exactly. Which you will get to see, because we also have some episodes planned for her place. Yes. Um, we're also going to speak on more personal topics that affect th things other than our love life, like our health. Mm -hmm. um, our autoimmune because, immune disorders. Because mm -hmm. we both we both suffer from different autoimmune disorders and we thought that was relevant because it's very significant in our lives. Yes, and, and we go through it on a daily basis. We maintain it on a daily basis. And we know that there's people out there with either the same illnesses or different autoimmune diseases that Hopefully, this kind of advice that we have for that episode can mm -hmm. help them in some way. Yeah, we'll be yeah. bringing on an actual doctor for that episode. Yeah, so we're very excited. <laughs> um, also, we also are keeping some of the fun things. Like we will update you on our love lives. A lot has happened. Yes. Um, some of us have new like flings. <laughs> some of us had like an actual potential serious thing. But we'll fill you in on that. A lot has happened in this pandemic. Like for it to be a pandemic, too much has happened. Like we were supposed just to be nice and quiet in our houses. I mean, what, what were we gonna do? Not move? Yeah. <laughs> anyway. Yes. What um, else? Yeah, we have we have a series of good topics, and I think that um, it's a good range too. So mm -hmm. it, it will, we'll go through a lot of. In terms of love, we're gonna explore. And talk, we're gonna explore how it feels to be rejected, um, what it's like to feel triggers, differences before and after 
when it comes to dating in college. Mm -hmm. Ooh, one thing I'm also excited about is that we'll also be challenging ourselves. Um, something that your therapist suggested, which is a 30 day fear challenge. I think that'll be exciting. So overcoming fears. Yeah. We'll, we'll actually be doing that together. Mm -hmm. um, and so it'll be cool to go through them and journal it and then be able mm -hmm. to share it with a podcast. Um, and then some fun things like, what would you want to ask on a first date, but then would not actually ask, <laughs> you know, <laughs> awkward things like that. Yeah. Um, so we have a lot of fun, exciting episodes coming up. And, and also a lot of serious, uncomfortable topics, but at least it's a good range. So we'll tune in every week. We're wilding every Wednesday. <laughs> we just want to say that for this season, it's, it's not only a new season for Women in the Wild podcast, but we almost feel like it's a new season for the whole world because this is oh, just, just happen. <laughs> like it just happens that we are starting season two and we were done with season one right when the coronavirus happened. Yeah, like we finished was, season 11. We were already doing Zoom. Yeah. Or like FaceTime yeah. episodes. So I feel like it's not only us in our personal lives, this is a new season. In the podcast, this is a new season. But also I'm sure for you guys listening, it's a new season yeah. because literally the world just went through a whole reset button. Mm -hmm. So we're excited to like to move forward together with you guys and overcome the more issues that might be coming up because yeah. that's what life is about. And unlearning toxic habits. <laughs> now the old world to the new world. Yeah. Yeah. So thank you for being here. We hope you really like it. We encourage you to listen to season one fully before coming to season two because that'll give you a better sense of how we've been growing together. Like even for us looking back at the episode from season one, it just feels, not only it feels like it was a long time ago when we filmed it, but it also feels like it was a whole nother person ago. Like both Adrian and I agree that we have like overcome so many things in the past few months. And these things are the things that we were talking about like as we were going through them in season one, that we both feel like we really came out of the other side. Like in a whole- Healthier. Yeah. You're glowing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so it, it's really transformative. It's been a transformative like experience. Yeah. Um, yeah and yeah, when, this is for real. Literally, like physically, environmentally, like we're both in different homes too. Um, <laughs> we are. I'm ta we're talking about this. I'm, my room is in the middle of an extreme makeover. Like. Yeah. And um, what was I gonna say? Yeah, if you haven't seen season one, you can totally watch the episodes in whatever order you want. Mm -hmm. But if you follow it chronologically, hopefully you'll see what we're talking about, how in each episode you feel like there's a little bit of growth, a little bit more understanding, mm -hmm. a little bit more self-love yeah. to get to the point where we are now in season two. Yes. And I guess like just to let our audience know that we pre-plan our season so that we're not just, you know, the flow is on purpose. Like these things are meant to actually be able to help. And, and also because we're going through it live, we're mm -hmm. actually living yeah. life. So yeah, it'll be cool. So welcome to season two. I hope you're just as excited as we are. This will be the new set. It'll be between this and Adrian's place. Yes. So also new, you know, new location, new view for you guys if you're watching. Mm -hmm. And we hope that you keep enjoying the content. Yeah, and we'll keep taking you around New York City with us because we just move so much now. We days. might be somewhere else next season. Yeah, and who knows what color my room will be next month. We really don't know. Anything can happen. We literally don't even know if we'll still be stuck at home next month or if I'll go to another country. Like, we really don't know. And that's kind of cool. Like, everything's yeah. up in the air and we're just here for each other in the process. Yeah. Well, you'll be the one thing that's consistent on all of this. You'll be my 